Hello everyone, this is Rakesh Dhawan. I am the inventor of Three Wheels of Magic and I wanted to thank you for your purchase of Three Wheels of Magic. So, uh, today in this video, I wanted to also talk about various parts of the trike. And we're gonna go through an assembly process as well so you can see how the whole trike is assembled. So the first part of the video, we're going to go through the various parts you're going to receive. This is only the mechanical and non-electric parts, what we're going to show and what comes in the box uh, with all the non-electric parts. And then we will later on discuss all the electric parts and the electric drive system, etc. All right. So in front of me is the main trike frame. It basically comes in two parts. You have the front part and the rear part. And I'm going to show you how they go together, but first we can get ourselves familiar with the frame, all right? So your uh, front boom goes in here, your uh, right wheel uh, goes in here, your left wheel goes in here, your seat goes on top of this here. This is your rear of the frame that's attached here. And then you have your rear suspension that uh, gets attached. Uh, here, right? So this is how uh, this whole thing comes together. Uh, so this part here gets attached to this part over here. All right. So this is your uh, uh, trike frame. Then, in terms of uh, routing the chain, what we have done is we have also introduced a single speed freewheel here, and then you have a two way routing here of your chain. Uh, so one patch will right here and another will go to the tube and then you also have the, the, the Mounting of the tube or the routing of the tube in the back through a small tube and this uh, This big wheel over here. All right, so so you can see here. So all these are chain routing mechanisms this is where uh, you have the folding of the frame so this uh, gets tied here when the frame is uh, uh, fully extended, uh, uh, not folded. All right, so this is your a beautiful red color frame. You have quick release for your front booms and, uh, and allows you adjustability. So talking about the adjustability, as you can see, this frame has been designed for people four feet tall to seven feet tall. You have adjustments to the seat here and then I'm going to show you more adjustments of the seat as we go through the video. All right. So, and the rear of the frame, as you can see, uh, your rear wheel goes here and, uh, and your rear rack gets mounted here. And also you have a flag mount, which is here. All right. So, so it's a very well built frame and very sturdy, uh, very strong, uh, you're gonna love it. Now, let's talk about the front boom. The front boom here, so the beauty of using a Falco E-Drive is that you don't lose your gears, uh, like you use, like you lose your gears uh, when using a mid-drive. So, you have three front gears here. Uh, this is a partial assembly you have the front derailleur already mounted on your front boom and then you have the cranks also mounted all we need to do is mount the pedals on this uh, front boom so this is a also i want to show you that this boom has markings on it which can be used to adjust the boom and you can adjust the boom for particular length uh, a height of the person who's going to use this trike. So, uh, beautifully designed front boom, and you're going to love this part as well. So, let's uh, look at uh, your handlebars. So, here I have got two handlebars. So, we have a handlebar for the right and a handlebar for the left. As you can see here, uh, these have what is called a twist grip shifters. Uh, so these are uh, ergonomically designed handlebars. These are two brake, brake levers 
and then the brake uh, cable, uh, shifter cables are already mounted onto the shifters. And then uh, this is the right handle bar where you can see where the throttle gets mounted. And then they come with these beautiful uh, grip shifts uh, or beautiful uh, uh, handlebar grips. So, uh, and you can see how uh, the, the wheels will get mounted uh, on, on uh, here and here. All right, so these are the two handlebars that come with your trike. So we're gonna put these uh, uh, over here, back, and then let's talk about uh, the beautiful seat we have. So the beautiful seat, uh, as you can see, essentially gets mounted on the trike frame here. It's a mesh seat. That means it allows for airflow uh, to happen around your body so you feel comfortable. So on the back of the seat, you will see a few uh, great features. So this is the bolt which has to be removed and put into here. And then you have a quick release bolt which goes through here. So this is the bolt which actually goes through here. And then you can adjust the angle of your seat uh, with, with this mechanism here. Now, in addition to these small adjustments, we also provide you bigger adjustments through these two uh, articles. So these two articles get mounted on the back of the seat and then you can adjust, you have, as you can see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten 10 adjustments of your seat angle, right? So, so this is also included with your trike purchase. Now, let's look at the wheels. So this is your left wheel. So it's gonna get mounted, uh, uh, as you can see right there. And then you also have your uh, right wheel. They are partially assembled. They have a disc brake on them and then they have uh, the right angle mechanism that gets bolted to your main frame. So this is your two 20 inch front wheels, all right? And then let's talk about the 26 inch rear wheel. Now, we give you two rear wheels with your trike. One is electric and the one is non-electric. So in the main box, you will receive this extra uh, free of cost, non-electric free wheel. This has got off-road uh, tires, uh, black spokes, and comes with a quick release, and also it comes with an eight-speed sprocket. So the idea is that you can switch between electric and non-electric wheel at any time to make your purchase more versatile. All right, now. Going through some of the small parts, uh, we have also these beautiful pedals. And these pedals have been designed especially to make sure your feet are secure when you are using your trike, all right? So they come with straps that can help secure your feet when you are riding your trike. So wonderful thing to have comes uh, uh, as standard with the trike, all right? Now, uh, this is your rear derailleur uh, that comes separate and, uh, and then gets mounted on the back of the, of the rear frame. Uh, let's uh, talk about the tie rods. Now, this uh, tie rod, uh, essentially, um, it will attach your uh, left wheel with the right wheel so that when you move your handlebars the two wheels will move in the same direction right so very important part of your uh, of your trike now we also provide you with a few zip ties to tie up all the cables and the routing you will also receive two brake cables with housing so those brake cables will get mounted on the handlebars 
and uh, and you definitely want to make sure you have them in your box. And then we also have two cable housings for your front and the rear derailleur, right? So these cable housings are important because cables are already mounted on your handlebar and then they need to be shielded with these cable housings, okay? In addition, you're going to receive uh, uh, a chain uh, with the three master links and, uh, and this chain is uh, essentially can be adjusted uh, based on uh, your height uh, and it does need to be adjusted based on your height uh, in order to use the tribe properly. All right. Uh, in addition, you are going to receive uh, uh, some extra hardware uh, that is needed to uh, to finish up that may be needed to finish up your uh, trike assembly. And I'm going to show you, I'm going to walk you through the tri complete trike assembly so that you know how the whole trike gets assembled. Uh, in addition, you're going to receive two, uh, two rubber bands. Now these rubber bands are used for parking your trike. So when you are at standstill or when you need to get off the trike uh, and you don't want the trike to move on itself, you can use these two rubber bands. You can also put your trike, if, once you have the electric wheel on it, into a negative resistant mode and that also prevents the trike from moving anywhere uh, because of that. 